When the first F-22 took off, it became clear that this aircraft wasn't an evolution, but a revolution. Neither America's allies nor its rivals would have anything comparable for many years. Being the love child of defense industry giants Boeing and Lockheed Martin, the F-22 boasts a supercruising speed of over 1.5 Mach without afterburners, a maximum speed of Mach 2.25, and remarkable stealth. One of the most astounding attributes of the F-22 is its thrust vectoring system, greatly enhancing its agility in aerial combat. After many heated discussions between the USAF and the US Congress, the Raptor is projected to stay in service until the next generation air dominance fighter becomes operational. Equipped with a new upgrade package, F-22 Raptor is poised to dominate the skies for at least another decade. After all, you can't keep a good bird of prey down. Upgrades to the F-22 have focused on enhancing its weapons capabilities, significantly expanding its target range, air-to-air -air attack capabilities, and lock-on launch precision. The integration of these software-enabled F-22 weapons upgrades, including versions of the AIM-9X and AIM-120D missiles, has been an ongoing process for several years. This integration was part of a multi-year software upgrade known as 3.2B, during which the weapons improvements were prototyped, tested, demonstrated and validated. Lastly, AIM-260 long-range radar-guided air-to-air missiles will further expand the Raptor's array of Beyond Visual Range, or BVR, weaponry. One of the upgrades in progress encompass all aspect infrared search and track, or IRST, capabilities. IRST is a passive method for detecting and targeting enemy aircraft, especially effective against radar-eluding stealth fighters. IRST systems detect heat signatures, enabling stealth aircraft like the Raptor to locate and lock onto enemy jets without emitting radar signals that would reveal their presence. Given the use of stealth aircraft by adversary air forces, an IRST is now regarded as a crucial sensing capability. Yet, equipping the F-22 with an IRST system similar to the F-35's Electro-Optical Targeting System, or EOTS, would necessitate costly and extensive modifications to the aircraft's structure. Hence, a more practical solution appears to be using an external pod. The stealth fighters are typically designed to maintain a stealthy profile without external munitions or fuel tanks. However, when operating over vast areas like the Pacific, additional fuel beyond internal storage is required. Currently, the Raptor can carry 600-gallon underwing fuel tanks, but these compromise its stealth. The new, low-drag, low-observable F-22 fuel tanks aim to counterbalance this stealth reduction. The F-22 low-drag tank and pylon, or LDTP, capability is critical to maintaining air superiority in the joint fight and combating emerging threats. The F-22 Raptor, categorized as a fifth-generation air superiority fighter, is regarded as the USAF's fourth-generation stealth aircraft technology. It stands as the inaugural operation aircraft to merge super cruise, super maneuverability, stealth and sensor fusion within a singular weapons platform. This unique combination equips it for missions primarily centered on counter-air operations, particularly in fiercely contested settings. The absence of a worthy opponent, its only official kill in two decades is a Chinese balloon, and not having an expert version have made this remarkable aircraft a financial burden. Also, being two decades old, F-22 had problems with incorporating certain technologies that have become essential to the USAF. However, since it is decided that this aircraft will remain in service until the next generation air dominance fighter is operational, updates and upgrades are ongoing to bridge the gap 
between the F-22 and the NGAD fighter 